Hey, it's Brent Conley with eXp Realty and the Lionheart Network. Um, welcome to, day, to today's show. I'm so excited to talk to you a little bit about online leads. Now, we generate online leads in a couple different markets, and we've been doing it for, I don't know, 15 years now. Um, we've done you know Google pay-per-click, we've done Facebook ads, all of this stuff, but we've, we've found a trend um, that uh, pretty much is, has been consistent that the trend over that time frame has been probably about 30 to 35% of the buyers out there are first time home buyers. And that's been pretty consistent. So I'm just gonna use, you know, let's just use a, a third, 33% of all online leads that are coming in are first time home buyers. So that means if you're gonna communicate with them properly, then 33% of those buyers need to learn about FHA mortgages. They need to learn about conventional mortgages with 5% down because everybody thinks in the public that you have to have 20% in order to buy a house. Um, I think those first time home buyers, a lot of them are VA, they're in the military and they have stipends that the military says, hey, if you're gonna live off base, you get $3,000 a month, plus you get your pay. And so now we can get them qualified that a lot of times they don't even understand that they can actually qualify. So I would also say in the recent history, you know, I would say, you know, 33% of them have been investors. There's a lot of cash out there in the marketplace. There's a lot of people buying second homes, Airbnbs and investment properties. Um, I, you know, Typically, it's 3% of the people out there that are investors, but there's so many investors out there. I think it's it's very uh, valuable to try to figure out and, and who they are and how to identify your lead flow if you're in a high investment market. If you're not in a high investment market, it's probably going to be like 2%, right? So like in the Phoenix market, there's a huge amount of investors. So that's definitely like 30%. There's probably 30%, maybe 35% first time home buyers, right? It could be even higher than that. There's probably, let's say 20, 25% that are moving from a different state. And, and then there's move up buyers. With the interest rates that are high, there's downsizing buyers. And um, so we're target marketing to each um, specific type of buyer and our language, our communication has to be specific to them. So we're gonna test the waters. We're gonna do some general uh, communication and, and uh, language in our emails and our follow-up drip campaigns. And then we're going to try to figure out and, and identify who they are and what they're trying to accomplish. Then we're gonna start having conversations and putting them on drips with those specific to what they want and what they need to be thinking about and talking about with us so they can view us as the expert to help them. Now, that for an average real estate agent out there, they they miss that step. They think all, all of the buyers that are registering on their website, they think all of those buyers are just trying to buy a home. That's not the case. I think it's really vitally important to, if you're gonna spend money on online lead generation, to quickly identify them at what specific type of buyer they are and then start communicating them like you would want to be communicated with if you were that specific type of buyer. Okay, this is Brent Conley. I am so excited that you uh, visit our channel today. Thank you for watching and please reach out to me if I can ever add that more value to you um, in, in your business. Thanks, have a great day.